Welcome back. As you previously saw in the last recipe, we made some shrimp and I told you I was going to make a broth. So this is the shell and the head that we removed from the shrimp. Going to place that with some salt, some bay leaf and some spice. And we're going to have some cyan and celery stick in there. And I am going to add to that two cups of water or to cover the ingredients that is in the pot. I'm going to add some pieces of onion. You could use a whole onion if you so desire. I also add clove. I forgot to mention I added clove and a nutmeg. So once that has come to a boil, I will let it cool down and then with all the ingredients add to a container and refrigerate it. So the next day I wanted to cook some rice but I would tire of the plain old simple rice. But before we continue with the rice, click the bell for new videos. As I said, we want to make some rice. So I'm going to use the broth. I'm going to use two cups of water and I am going to use some old bit to season the rice. So normally you'll just boil a, a, a rice and you know you have it with whatever sauce you're having. But today I'm going to make a stew rice. So I'm using some sugar. I am going to caramelize the sugar. Once it has, has melted and started to bubble like you're about to see here, you know the sugar is properly well melted. You're going to add your rice and you're going to coat it properly. Then I am going to add my broth. I added all together a cup and a half of broth because I like a very grainy rice, especially this type of rice. Now this is also a method of how we would cook a pilau. But before we continue, So as I mentioned, this is the method of making a pilau, but I'm not making a pilau, I'm just making a steamed rice with my shrimp broth. So I'm going to get some leaves, you can use banana leaves, plantain leaves, I have some to cut at the moment, but we are just going to cut a leaf. And this is how a traditionally a Caribbean pot a pilau or cook up, however you want to say it would be cooked. So you would take the fig leaf, rest on the rice, cover it, and then you rest another seal cover on top of that and leave that to cosame and make sure it cook up all nice. And once it is the texture that you want, give it a little fluff a little bit and taste to see if it has enough salt and that's it. This was just an easy and simple way to just change things around with your meals instead of a plain rice, make a nice stew rice. Thanks so much for stopping by. Do have a blessed day.